The Minnesota Department of Health confirms what many have believed for years. People working or living near water gremlin may face health risks. A new assessment of the manufacturing plant found the toxic chemicals that it puts into the air could cause cancer, among other problems. Our Jennifer Merrily has been investigating the company for three years, and she's on top of the latest development. She joins us now. Jen? Well, the public health assessment had a few key findings, and what struck me is exposure to this chemical TCE at unsafe levels may have increased the risk of certain cancers and birth defects in some people living near Water Gremlin in White Bear Township. We've been talking about the impact to people in our reporting for years, and this spells it out in the most clear way we've seen so far. In early 2019, the state levied a $7 million fine against Water Gremlin for the excessive release of TCE, and it ordered the plant to make changes. Our report on elevated lead levels in kids of water gremlin employees temporarily shut the plant down. Workers were unknowingly taking the lead home, poisoning some kids. We spoke with a woman who lives near the plant about this latest development. She's part of a concerned citizens group that has pushed for health answers and more for years. I think about the fact that um, cancer doesn't show up the next day after you've been exposed. I wonder who, who will be sickened that has not yet been sickened. I worry about myself. I worry about my children that I raised in this home. A Water Gremlin spokesperson told me they have worked to address the issues in the report and said the safety of workers and the community is their top priority. Well, our reporting led to Minnesota being the first state to ban the toxic chemical TCE. Tonight at 10, we'll dig deeper into these findings, and you'll hear from a woman who lives near the plant who has cancer. Plus, we'll look at the worker impact. Amelia? Jen, we look forward to that report tonight. Thank you.